Hi, I'm James Rahut. I'm a designer at IBM Design here in Austin, Texas. And I'm going to be doing a day in the life for Free Code Camp. Um, it's 8.30. I need to head out so I can stop by the gym before work. And sorry about the mess. I just got married to an awesome person. All right, let's go. And when I say go to the gym, I mean go to Chick-fil-A for the breakfast. So I'm walking into the office now. Uh, it's a giant campus, actually. IBM's not the only person here. But what's really funny is IBM originally built this campus uh, either in the 60s or 70s. And it's right north of, it was on the outskirts of Austin when they built it. And there really wasn't anything else here. And since then, now it's the now the largest outdoor mall and office space is right across the street. So all of a sudden, it's the place to be in Austin. Uh, usually, the family people that work here live uh, in a suburb north of here, and then the people that want to be where it's at live downtown. And this is right in the middle, which is nice. I'm all about the commute, so I live like five minutes down the road from here. Uh, but it's a pretty nice campus. Uh, we got basketball court, sand volleyball, which I don't really use. Uh, but my favorite part is that there's just so many restaurants in that outdoor mall right across the street to take advantage of for lunch. So it's 9 a.m. I get into the office, eating my Chick-fil-A. But really, the first task at hand is checking the email and the Slack. You think I'd have a lot of emails, but rarely anymore, because all of IBM is on Slack now. Crazy promotion, I know, right? So I just have a million Slack channels to, and messages to check. We're celebrating our manager recently becoming a design principal. <laughs> One of our teammates decorated her desk, celebrating projects she's worked on, and now we're all signing little notes for her. Okay, so I've looked through all my emails, not many, looked through all my slacks, lots, and now I'm looking through GitHub Enterprise and public GitHub for whatever issues, PRs that I need to look at. Um, the GitHub Enterprise, I look for mostly PRs for different projects on my wider team that I need to review. And then on public GitHub, I look through because one of the house chores in my job is uh, maintaining a lot of public repos that really are mostly just assets for the IBM design language. So that includes things like icons and colors, the charting library we've been trying to get off the ground publicly. Uh, and the, it's kind of a half developer, half designer job because we have these build processes that we develop to automatically generate the assets for every change. And then on the design side, we have to actually make sure they they're usable for when designers are designing designs, you know? So that takes about like a half hour usually as long as there's not something crazy to look at. So right now I'm backseat coding with Trevor, uh, one of my teammates on a different project. We're just trying to make sure his DevOps goes smoothly for this project he's starting. So now I'm going to do an exercise for about a half hour of just exploring uh, content skeletons for when new data and experience is loading in and, and see if any best patterns uh, come out of this exercise. I'm just going to try to keep going as wide as possible. It was something I started yesterday. So another project's running into Bluemix problems. But the nice thing about being in the studio in Austin is instead of dealing with tech support for it, uh, we're just going to go down to the Bluemix floor and start asking friends that work for Bluemix. And they'll probably solve it in one minute. And of course they figured it out in one minute. It was no problem. Um, I want to just share with you the entrance to my floor. We have two special guests that are always at the entrance. We have two of the robots from the Watson commercial that premiered at the last Super Bowl uh, with Carrie Fisher. 
uh, and they've been here for like over a year now. I guess they're permanent guests at the studio. So I've got a good amount of time left uh, before lunch, so I'm going to add a uh, some search functionality that some uh, that a teammate wanted for one of their experiences, uh, just so they could search between the different users to find them. Get to eat lunch across the street, velvet taco with the buds. <laughs> Getting back from lunch, saying hi to the robots. Hi, robot. Hi, robot. That robot's confused. All right, so I'm back from lunch. Uh, I've got a little bit of time before my first meeting of the afternoon, so I just want to give you a tour of the Austin studio real quick. Uh, as fast as I can. So a lot of the, this is the seventh floor. I work on the eighth floor. But the seventh floor is actually full of these open spaces where we do a lot of workshops. Um, these workshops are typically client workshops or IBM teams coming to Austin to do a workshop. But we also do them for uh, where if you're an entry-level designer hired for IBM, it doesn't matter which studio around the world you're being deployed to, you always come here for a three-month design boot camp. And so one of those open spaces is your home for three months where you do a bunch of crazy projects. Uh, we also have this uh, media st studio where we're cranking out a lot of digital media for people. This is all the colleges represented uh, here at the Austin studio. Doesn't mean you have to go to a, to a college, but we're very well represented. This is our make lab. Uh, we do a lot of screen printing here. Uh, you can, and also all sorts of projects. You can see some of the examples of the great screen prints that happen here. Uh, back there we got a maker bot. And then this is the eighth floor where I work. Uh, it's a lot more uh, actual just product design teams. So you'll see a lot more desks down here. We've got uh, the power systems team, proud of their hardware as well as their digital designs. This is one of my favorite corners because we represent Austin with the ACL Music Festival. Uh, with all the posters of every year, and then we've got a video game cabinet. And then this beast is uh, one of those crazy Microsoft hubs. I love it. Let me just uh, leave a great piece right here for everyone to see. And we'll just let whoever the next person is discover that. And then this is my little turf area. Uh, I like to astroturf my apartment balconies, so I use all the leftover turf just at my desk. Uh, so I'm back at my computer. Uh, first thing I want to do is we at IBM we have this big uh, educational program for front end developers called Peducation where uh, we get to present to each other uh, new topics across the whole company uh, live. So right now I want to uh, create a proposal for a new one about why CSS and JS is here to stay. And uh, it's not just a fad, it's really exciting work, especially uh, coming off of a high since Styled Components version 2.0 just came out. And I love it. And of course, all the submissions for a front-end development education program have to be on a GitHub repo. So every submission idea is an issue itself. Uh... So I just finished coding at 4 p.m. today and gonna finish the day off by hanging out with my buddy Evan and explaining more about the skeletons we need to design. It's getting near the end of the day. One last thing I really need to do is clean my desk. Uh, at IBM Design, we use a lot of sticky notes, and my desk is covered in notes from this past week. 
So it's five o'clock on Memorial Day Friday uh, for the non-Americans watching. That means we have Monday off. So everyone naturally wants to take uh, Friday before for vacation time. So that means there's nobody here. But that's okay because we get to go now. So we're headed out, going home, gonna be safe and do lots and lots of work over the weekend. Not really. One last thing, I want to share my favorite sign in this whole studio. We have an emergency exit door, and if you push it, an alarm goes off, so we never like when people push it. But this was how we improv stopping people from pushing it. <laughs>